Welcome to Pixios Paint, a token pocket tutorial. We're going to go over all the features of token pocket today. All right, that's what the canvas looks like today. The first thing you're going to do is download the official token pocket app from either the App Store or Google Play. Okay, this tutorial is for people that already have an account, so you're going to import your private key. And we'll go over another tutorial for people that don't have an account in a different video. So here's the section where you're going to paste in your private key. Make sure no one's looking and uh, please never save your private key on your phone. The next thing you're going to do is set a password for the phone so that whenever you do anything in the game it'll ask you for that password. It's just for your phone. After you've entered the password then you're going to hit start importing. Press that button. Alright, import successful. So you've just successfully imported your EOS account into Token Pocket. The next thing you're going to do is click the Discover button, and there's the Pixios Paint Dapp, so click on that. After you click, it will give you this uh, message, and it's fine. Hit OK. You can be redirected. That's fine. Here we are in the Pixios Paint Dapp. You can see the canvas is getting crazy. So here, I'm going to show you how to paint and buy a pixel. And then you want to select the brush paint pixel brush and of course you get your color whatever color you want and I've chosen that bright pink when you are ready to buy you press the button down below buy after you do that it'll show you how much it costs and then if you're okay with that the price then you hit confirm and whenever you uh, purchase a pixel you notice you get free Pixios tokens. So I just got 2.5 Pixios tokens when I bought that pixel, which is the mining aspect of this game. This is the contract that pops up uh, for the EOS blockchain. Just make sure it says buy pixels. That's the most important thing. Just read the contract and hit confirm. When painting, make sure and buy small batches at uh, small amounts at once and and you, the reason you want to do that is because if you take too long to paint someone else could buy those pixels and then you'd lose your entire artwork so just make sure and buy small amounts so paint some buy the pixels paint some more and buy those and then if you mess up like if you draw a bunch of stuff and you don't like it you can undo all operations just click on the trash can so like let's say you drew a bunch and you're like I hate all that stuff so click on the trash can it will undo all the stuff that you drew if you only want to remove one pixel use the curly undo button it's right below the eye the stats and the leaderboard so those are buttons at the top so that's the leaderboard it will show you who is painted the most and in order and then that other one the charts button up there it shows you the stat you can also find out who has painted over your masterpiece and you use the uh, the I button and you can also find out how much each pixel is worth like how much it costs to buy it so you're gonna click on the I which is the investigate button after you click on that, then you're going to go in the canvas and click on the pixel that you are interested in finding out info on. So right now here we pick the center pixel, the 500, the 500, the very center one. We want to find out how much it is. It's now worth, if you want to buy it, it costs 6,053 EOS. And it also tells you who owns that. If no one has bought anything, uh, bought the pixel before, it will cost 0.05 EOS. And you can see that uh, here because it won't have a name attached underneath it. It'll just say 0.05 EOS. 
So that's that's how much each EOS, uh, excuse me, pixel costs. If no one has purchased it, you're the first buyer of that. It's time to learn how to stake your Pixios tokens. All right, we got a stake there. All right, we're going to click on the piggy bank at the very top. You might have to double click it. Sometimes I had to click it twice in order to engage. After you click the piggy bank, that brings up the staking section here. And just type in how much, how many tokens you want to stake. And I decided to stake all of these, which is the 200. So you put in 200 and then you press the stake button and that should engage you. Now, please don't use a VPN with Token Pocket app. It doesn't work. So don't use a VPN. All right, after that, you've done that. If you run out of CPU, then you're gonna click on that little button in the bottom right-hand corner that says CPU, and that will take you to the CPU emergency. And when, um, when you get to the CPU emergency, you're gonna input your EOS account name. So you just put your account name that you use to play the game. And you have to be a player because apparently there's there's a way to check that. Uh, it has to be 12 characters, of course. And then after you put your account name in there, you hit the submit button. And this is to make sure there's no bots doing that. So do the puzzle. And then you should have that taken care of if you have any issues with cpu go into the cpu uh, emergency telegram channel and that's it for today i'm your host stella bell draw responsibly <laughs>